going to have uh, a few sharp wet weather that most of us have seen during today. And we haven't quite finished with that yet either. Still some pretty heavy bursts to come across southern parts of England over the next few hours. We have got a Met Office severe weather warning. That'll all ease away eastwards through the latter part of the night. A few showers following on behind. A few clear spells as well for Northern Ireland. Temperatures here taking a bit of a dip down to three degrees, but most places staying that few degrees higher. And then tomorrow it looks fairly cloudy at first, but I think the sun will soon break through in most places. Probably Northern Scotland, one exception, where it will stay rather damp and cloudy. And elsewhere, well, we'll get a scattering of showers breaking out as the day wears on. One or two sharp ones perhaps through the afternoon across the uh, Midlands, but many northern parts of England I think could well get away with a largely dry afternoon and with uh, all that sunshine temperatures into double figures it shouldn't feel too bad. As I mentioned so much of Highland Scotland staying rather cloudy, a little bit of sleet or wet snow over the very tops of the mountains, just a scattering of showers across Northern Ireland and certainly some sunshine in between the showers across Wales and the southwest of England, but one or two sharp ones around I think. Uh, so if you do catch one of those, well, it will get rather wet, but equally you'll get some drier spells in between. Nothing like as windy tomorrow either. So actually with temperatures of 13 to 15 degrees across the southeast and very few showers, it's going to feel almost spring-like. A mix of sunny spells and showers again into Monday and some dry and fairly warm weather on the way by the middle of next week. Bye-bye.